Alright guys, Lord Nolan here and I'm feeling I'm feeling a lot better than I was. My stomach, my chest, my you know, my heart and all that stuff like that, my lungs and everything. Uh they're feeling a lot better. It turns out though, the reason why I was having trouble breathing is because uh it was apparently it was a bad like pollution day like it, like it was like three days of bad pollution days and the air outside was literally making it hard to breathe and making me dizzy like <clears throat> part of the uh the reason why i was so anxious is because i couldn't figure out why i couldn't breathe because i like i wasn't freaking out a lot except for when i started breathing funny and it turns out it was because there's a thing apparently called bad pollution days here in um, like in San Antonio you'd think that San Antonio wouldn't have bad pollution days but apparently they do so I uh, I figured out how to deal with that I got a bunch of new filters and stuff like that and filtered the air that comes in and out of the trailer and uh, and I started wearing a mask when it seems like the like the pollution is really high so the the mask filters out the pollution so I can actually get some air which is weird like wearing a mask just to be outside it's like I've never really had that issue so it's like it's it's kind of awkward to have to wear a mask just to go out you like I don't know it was weird but like uh, I was already wearing a mask to be inside of other places so you know it's just one it's just you know don't take it off until you get back uh, or something like that but um yeah uh, uh i went and saw uh my boys yesterday and uh i kind honestly I, i'm not gonna lie i kind of like i kind of freaked out because of the whole air thing and I, I didn't know about the pollution thing yet and so uh i just kind of i just went and grabbed up my family because I was like I was just driving around at first and I went and grabbed up my family and like I didn't intend to do that but like uh we're all we're all negative like we've all recently been uh to check and see that we're negative for the virus and stuff like that so we all know that we're negative so it wasn't like a uh oh you know we could get sick type thing seeing each other it's like we all know we're negative so uh being around each other was fine and uh the last place that i've been that was public was literally the the hospital before then so uh uh i went and i saw my family and uh my sister who also has like uh suffering from anxiety and stuff like that but she's actually gone and like talked to someone about it she uh she actually gave me a whole bunch of tips on what to do when I'm feeling anxious and so that really that helped me and she's the one that told me about the whole pollution days thing and I was like oh okay well okay that that makes sense like why I couldn't breathe even though I was calm and stuff why I couldn't breathe because like there was times where I was calm and like uh, the anxiety wasn't attacking me but I still couldn't breathe and then that set off an anxiety attack because I didn't understand why I couldn't breathe so like that helped me a lot and then we went to see my boys and it was it was just a bunch of hugs and a bunch of board games and like i i really needed that like i really needed that like i haven't felt that good in a long time ever since i like ever since i that first anxiety attack and i stopped seeing them like I haven't felt that good in a long time and I really needed to see them and they really needed to see me and I'm just I'm just happy that it happened I'm happy that we we finally got together again and I'm gonna try and see them more often now that I'm now that I I know that I don't have the coronavirus and all stuff like that and I know other people around me don't have it like I'm gonna try and see them more often and uh, my boys are both doing the virtual schooling so I don't have to worry about them getting the virus and giving it to me or nothing like that. And I don't go any places that, like, I haven't already been already. 
that are relatively good at keeping their their places sanitary because if they're not if they're not a sanitary place i don't even go there i'm like nah i ain't, I ain't want to be over there so it's like i only go places where they keep the sanitation level high so i know that it's like okay if anything is wrong then it's literally because somebody went out of their way to give it to me so uh like we can meet every now and then to uh see each other and stuff like that and i was wearing a mask everybody that was with me was wearing a mask we all went in there wearing a mask and we're, I mean, we're gonna do that every time because i know that even if it seems like we don't have it we could possibly get it just from going to the store and stuff like that so i'm still being cautious and i'm wearing a mask while i'm there but i'm i'm going to see them more uh moving forward because uh honestly i like when i, when I stopped seeing them even my health declined like not just my mental health but just my health in general declined because like they keep me on my toes they keep me active they keep me they keep me you know moving like they keep my mind sharp they keep me you know what i mean like it like their their questions they're they're they're, they're talking they're they're learning and stuff that it keeps me learning like everything that they're like every time they try and ask me a question it's like hey, you know i gotta find the answer for that and it keeps my brain active and it keeps me moving and organized and stuff and so without that stimulation without them literally being near me or around me and stuff like that I, I was falling apart and it was bad and uh now that i know the other things that were triggering me uh i can handle those and so uh i got a few things that i still need to do in order to really like have it under control but uh i think i'm doing i'm think i'm doing all right and uh, the stomach thing's almost gone I'm I'm just eating bland foods and that's just how that goes. I gotta eat bland food, and uh, yeah. Uh, other than that, I'm 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 doing pretty good. So uh, I, I and also I, I launched a Patreon. So if you wanna see, uh, you know, some Patreon exclusive things, you wanna get merch, you wanna get uh, you wanna be able to chat with me uh, and other people that like are in this community that I'm I'm trying to build uh you know it's uh the lowest one is five dollars and I'm gonna try and make one maybe a little lower than that to maybe be like uh one or two dollars I don't know how Patreon works like that still so I'm like I'm 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 working the site still so I'm probably gonna try and make one that's a little cheaper than that too uh it's the uh the merch i can't i can't lower the prices on the merch that that's they make it so i can't lower the prices on the merch that's how that goes they they tell me put it on uh the like these certain tiers because if not then they they won't necessarily make it because <coughs> ew, because uh they won't make their money back they they I, they get some money for making the merch for me so like if, if i don't if i don't charge a certain amount they won't make their money back and so that's why like i can't go any lower with the merch um and i'm gonna start making a patreon exclusive series so you know pretty soon the only way you're gonna be able to see some of my videos, not all of them, but some of my videos is through Patreon. So, and they're gonna be pretty live. So, uh, YouTube is still gonna be popping and all that stuff like that. And I'm gonna start making more videos and all that, but pretty soon there'll be a Patreon only series, maybe a couple. So, uh, that being said, uh, I'm feeling good. Patreon is gonna blow up pretty soon. And, uh, you know, it'll be, It'll be a big community, I hope. I'm going to go see my boys later. And, uh, you know, I, I hope everybody's staying safe. I hope everybody's being uh, nice to one another. We all, we're all in this together, okay? Whether it be mental health, physical health, or the well-being and safety of everybody around you, we're all in this together. Uh, and I don't know, that's my message or something. I don't know. That's my message for today. Yeah, Lord on that.